no point in carrying your heavy pack out to a viewpoint when you can leave it right here. I am so glad I came up this short side trail. 100% worth it. I just sat there and filtered my water. And it's misty. It's hazy, but it's flippin' beautiful. There's a lake over here. I wish I had time to explore a little more, but we have to make choices. And my choice is making it another nine point something miles for fresh brisket that is a quarter mile off the trail, which I'm probably not actually gonna get. I'm probably not gonna be there in time. I heard he runs out because he's making it himself and it's good. <laughs> um, but I can at least get a soda pop or something. We'll see. That's the goal. Bye, Chimney Rock. You're pretty. <laughs> well, hello. <sighs> Aren't they pure magic? <gasps> oh my goodness. Oh, hello. I'm so lucky. Today's a good day. <laughs> so I just had a cry fest from finding those pink lady slippers and just what a beautiful day. <laughs> there are bugs crawling all over me. I'm wearing these glasses, not because I need them to see, but because I need to keep the bugs out of my eyes. Joseph and Coffee Break um, are section hikers and they're really nice. And Joseph has a, a, a bug net already. I thought it would be out too early for them. <laughs> they're biting me. And I need an all over bubble body bug net. That's what I need. But those flowers, oh my God. I saw them from so far away because I was just filming the cave. Um, and I, when I saw them, I was like, did somebody put like fake, you know, plastic or wooden cut out flower <laughs> flowers over there? And then I was like, oh no, those are pink lady slippers. <gasps> Orchids just growing. Like they wouldn't do that at my house. <laughs> they would die real quick at my house. <laughs> Poor little things. Um, oh my God, so tender. Anyway, it was, it's a good day. I'm hopefully nine point something miles away from brisket or a hamburger, a soda, something good, and sitting with other people and eating. Yeah, so I gotta go. <laughs> I have a joke I keep telling myself. This is the furthest north I've ever been on the Appalachian Trail. I can say it all the way to Katahdin. Now this is the furthest north I've ever been on the Appalachian Trail. Now this is the furthest north I've ever been on the Appalachian Trail. See, it never gets old.
Coca-Cola is my go-go juice. And when all the ice melts, it's like you've got second drink. So we are currently here and we have to go all the way. Oh my gosh, look at that dirty fingernail. Oh. Okay, we're going all the way up to here. And then we're gonna go home for a little bit. And then we're gonna come back here. And then we are gonna go all the way down to Springer Mountain, Georgia. And that's the plan. This is the first time I've pitched my tent on a platform, which my tent is not made for, but they have some hooks. They don't have enough. I just put my tent stake through the loop here and hold it in. Um, that worked on this side. And then I had to get a little bit more creative over. That one worked too. And then here, I just have the tent stake horizontal and under there and I have this one going this way here another there and there we go we have a pitch tent on a platform hopefully I don't get wet tonight 12.4, no, sorry, 12.2 miles today. My feet are done, but my legs were good. Um, and I'm gonna throw all my stuff in there, get washed up, and then make my dinner. Mm -hmm.